Welcome back, lovies, to Vlogmas Day 11. Today I'll be sharing juicing, my weigh-in, exercising, cooking breakfast, and doing a little self-care with me getting a pedicure and lashes. So pull up a chair or pop a squat. Hey guys, there is nothing like drinking the juice of some freshly juiced fruits and veggies early in the morning and all throughout the day. The juice is so refreshing, good, tasty, delicious, and amazing, especially when it is freshly juiced. There's nothing like God's product, nothing on this earth. The artificial juices that they sell in the store can't even measure up. It does not even compare to some freshly juiced fruits and veggies. And for those who doesn't even like fruits and veggies, or maybe veggies, let me tell you, when you mix them together, there's nothing like it. The taste is amazing. I weighed in this morning at 191.6 pounds. And as I told you guys, I had been eating things like fatty nuts. As a matter of fact, I was eating cashews. And the scale was fluctuating up and down. And it also did that when I ate that salad with that poppy seed dressing. But now my weight loss seems to be back on track. And y'all, oftentimes we can think that just because something is healthy and we may get the impression that it's nutritious, but often it could work against our progress in our weight loss journey. Working out. I'm going to go ahead and get it in. During this exercise routine, I am on my trainer once again. And you all will be seeing that I tried different exercises as well during this session. I also picked up my five pound weights and used them like I did in my previous exercise routine. And I think it was a really good workout. I worked up a sweat. And I think all together I may have done close to an hour. Some of which you will not see because I didn't record the first 15 minutes and I edited a lot of the scenes out of this video. And once again, it was cloudy outside, dreary looking, and I believe it sprinkled for a little bit. But that is why I decided to go ahead and get on my trainer. And I believe all together I end up with about 8,000 steps. And as you all can see here, I use my hand weights my five pound weights and did multiple exercises on the trainer while I was getting my steps in. It was a really good workout and I worked up a sweat. Hear me when I tell you I worked up a sweat. <laughs> Look at that. I'm already having to wipe my face down, but let's get back to it. <laughs> I don't know what those are called, but honey, they really work your arms. And that right there, oh, that was tiring. That was really tiring. I don't think I did many more of those. But I kept going. I just want to continue to be dedicated, work hard at this, and see results. And I believe I will. I believe that I will as long as I continue to stay committed and focused on this weight loss journey. Well guys, after I finished my exercise, I went ahead and started to make me some breakfast. I ended up scrambling me some cheese and eggs. My eggs were sticking 
and it was kind of hard trying to hold that camera. I couldn't grab the uh, frying pan, so my eggs were really sticking. And then, on top of that, I had the fire up way too high, way too high. After my eggs were done, I went ahead and added my cinnamon toast into the toaster. And I added some orange marmalade onto my toast. I try not to add too much. Just enough to taste. I'm placing my eggs on top. And now I'm getting ready to actually put my beef sausage into the pan. And y'all, if you didn't know, now you know. I love my beef sausage. Burnt. I think it'll be safe to say that I love a burnt sausage. Y'all, any meat that I eat it has to be cooked well done. And when it comes to a steak, it has to be well, well, well done. And the breakfast is served. And it was yummy. But now it's time for some self-care. And who is Ashy? Me. But I purposely didn't put on any lotion or anything because I knew I was going to get my feet done. And my legs massage. So yeah. I decided to treat myself and, and there is nothing like a good pedicure along with a massage. Yes, I had to treat myself. And next, I got my lashes done. I've always done the reverse lashes ever since I started wearing some. I normally do them myself, but I wanted to treat myself and just be pampered. And she did a good job. There was this other lady that I used to go to another salon that is much closer to me. And she would have those lashes on so fast. And she didn't have to do all the uh, extra tugging and whatnot. She would just put the lashes on and they would be there. I would be like, okay, you're done already? But she did an excellent job as well. I didn't have any problems with the lashes at all. But loveys, there is nothing like self-care. We all need to treat ourselves sometimes like the queens that we are and we know that we are. Because if we don't take care of ourselves, who will? So ladies, let's continue to show up for ourselves so we can be everything we need to be for our family members. But loveys, it's time to go. I love you guys and I want you all to know that I'm always praying for you. And you know what my main prayer is, is that if you don't know Jesus as your personal Savior you and your Lord, you will make him your is personal Savior and your Lord today and come okay. on into the kingdom of God and Maybe begin to activate and demonstrate the kingdom of God that is within you. Luke chapter 17 okay. verses 20 and 21. Happy Vlogmas day 11. I hope y'all enjoyed the juicing, the cooking, the exercising, and the self-care. I'm hoping to see y'all real soon. Stay safe.